in order to sort of set ourselves apart from the original CSI, we had to take a different spin. And I think David was really, really quite smart in the choice that he made because our show is the more fantasy, it's glamorous, and in a lot of ways it is the more comic book style version of the show. Welcome to Divorce of the Future. He has created a character that he has to uh, stay very true and specific to. He's very in tune with the audience when it comes to that. And, uh, you know, and it's amazing what he's done. I mean, we were actually traveling down here together and we're at the airport and, uh, you know, there must have been three people that did their, you know, Horatio Kane impersonation. And it's great. And I'm like, you know, I'm, I said, you know, you made history, man. There are a lot of people out there who do Horatio Kane impressions. Even me. Do I'm you? not even one of the best, which is too bad. <laughs> I mean, I wish I was good at Horatio King. <clears throat> what do you think of all those impressions? It's a little surreal and a real honor when somebody like Jim Carrey does an impression of you. That was mind blowing, and I and I, it was a, it was a lot of fun for everybody here. Well, I guess we've found our man. I'm looking at it going. Man, he's good. And but he has the and they had the camera angle set up correctly and he worked those glasses perfectly. So. Is that the key? What's the key? Well the glasses are very important, but it's how you enter the frame, deliver the line, and exit the frame. So we decided to ask his castmates to do their best Horatio impressions. That is my job. This would be my first and probably only uh, impression of Horatio King. Should I do it? Yes, please. Was it murder? <laughs> okay, Rex Lynn doesn't have it down, but maybe Emily Proctor does. Do you have one? Of course. Can you do it for me? Of course. Looks like he's having a bad day. <laughs> <laughs> and what about Eva LaRue? We don't get food again. <laughs> Horatio is so intimidating, it gets Jonathan Togo nervous. I'm going to get in so much trouble for this. But this is CBS, so I can't really get in that much trouble. This is Horatio came with allergies. <laughs> it's pollen season. For the early show, Tracy Smith, CBS News.